Previously on Sonic Zombies. Anyways, fast forward. Hello, humans. My name is Beetle Penny, and today we are back in the zombie saga of Sonic. You guys seem to enjoy the uh, Sonic Zombies Origins reaction video. So, because of that, and because I still wanted to watch this anyway, we're gonna continue on. The official episode two we'll, we'll, we'll watch next. What we're gonna watch right now is actually a. It's weird. It's like a prequel, but not a prequel. It's like a continuation of the first part, but it's a prequel of the whole se as, as the series of as a whole sonic and zombie apocalypse 3 you can even tell because like the the audio doesn't sound as crisp <laughs> those are pretty real sound effects what do you think can i get that sound so effect? like this is the planet mobius obviously here we are in sonic's house or damn it camera guy was still working on his methods of transitioning from one scene to another you know at the cost of a planet it's fine but you know we don't really gotta talk about it we can just continue on but inside we continue from last time where we see rose and she was on the computer and shadow was like on the computer and Boops. she's like looking at shadow and she's like hey shadow what are you doing i'm over here and Oh, we have Sonic and Tails playing Xbox because that's what you do in an apocalypse is you play Xbox. Not in this day and age. I don't know about playing Xbox. You know, most of you will probably be playing a, a PlayStation or a Switch. Most likely a Switch because it's more mobile. There were zombies everywhere. Oh my God. Look at them all. I everywhere is just that Look, one spot. I'll go over there right now. I, I, Mr. Zombie. Cameraman oh, yeah. cameo. Oh, yeah. Yes. <laughs> Suddenly, Amy came in. She was like, Sonic, Sonic. Oh my God, Sonic, Sonic. Look at those people outside. Trying to eat these like, have these big babies on their head. This is this is like a behind the scenes type of deal before things actually really got cooking. Bitch, you broke the TV. How could you do that? <laughs> Never in my life did I ever think Sonic calling Amy a bitch would be that funny, but for it caught me off guard. The voice acting and and just calling her a bitch in general just caught me off guard. Wait, what? What are we supposed to do about all these zombies? They're gonna come over here. Oh shit! Damn it! Damn it! Damn my voice. <laughs> it is good thing for you that I was trying to find out how to defeat the zombies because I am so good at the computer and I use the guns because I have the Shadow the Hedgehog game and it's so good because it's really TV. Oh, hold on a second. I gotta kill myself so I can be Shadow for the shot. Oh, I'm so good with Gary. There we go. Ah, I'm dead. Now I can be shadow. Visual technical difficulties for comedy purposes. I'm I'm in. Then suddenly Shadow blew up the door and he ran outside to kill the zombies. You will not defeat the bees, zombies because I have gun. Look at the bee. Boom 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 boom. <laughs> yeah. And the boom and the boom and the boom boom boom. boom, 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 boom. Well, unfortunately for our hero. <sighs> could save it from the zombies. <laughs> shadow died? Wait a minute. Because of shadow being dumb, the zombies are coming in. Uh, what are we supposed to do now? Come on, everybody. Let's go. We can run away from the zombies. Just stick behind me, because I'm the fastest. Yeah. Oh, look, Shadow's still alive. He's right there. But because Sonic talks in an up and down voice, they couldn't understand him. So the zombies got in, and they started to eat them. So Amy and Tails are just dead. And and maybe Rouge. Then he sound couldn't say anything. So then he, like, ran away again. I love how the narrator is just like getting like tired. Like he's he's like, oh, you know, Sonic you know, is fighting the zombies, and I don't even care anymore. Like he's gonna die anyway, and the series is gonna end. Like oh, look over there, that's a base. I could hide there, no problem. So he's the last one alive. So is everyone just dead in the next episode? But then Sonic didn't see it. But there was Shadow, and he was a zombie. What? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and he's dead? Wait and a minute. Shadow aided him dead. What? Wait a minute. But no wonder this is like a prequel slash not a prequel because everyone just dies. Well, that's the end of that episode. We'll just uh, cut to the next one, I guess. Uh, Zoom. Sonic and the zombie thing told. Wait a minute, the last one was three. Well, wouldn't this make it the- He acknowledges the bullshit. I love it. Look, there's all the zombies. There they are. Look, 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 look. It's all cool. Look, look. He really leans into the kid the kid voice a lot more. And I don't remember if that's a, re of a recurring thing throughout the whole series, but that is the main thing that this kind of goes towards. Go. The Sonic's face and- Ow. Okay. <laughs> so, so
Editing Beetle at a smack effect because he felt pain as he ran right into that door at high speed. Rouge fixed everybody. She brought Tails and Amy back to life. What? And she's got... Oh, my, oh. Yes! <laughs> so there's Shadow. And he was sitting there concerned because Sonic is his butt buddy. And, and it's, yeah, look. Look at his butt. They are butt buddies. I didn't even think about that. If there's any reason why, why Sonic was calling Shadow a faker in Sonic Adventure 2... Not because they share the same look, but because they have the exact same butt. Tails is, is really concerned because they're best friends. And then Amy is, oh, wow. Look at Amy. She's just so high poly. At least nobody's eyes are messed up, which is which is a positive. Oh, my God. I'm so worried because I love Sonic. A lot, more, a lot more Amy personality in this one. You do not have to worry about Sonic. He's very strong. I believe that he will come back and no problem. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It's going to be fun when we see him again because he will own friends. Fun fact, this is actually... I, if, if I remember anything from this series, this one was the one that started me on this series. I, I found Sonic Zombie Thing 2 first, and I didn't know there were other parts. Or maybe it was like during the, the whole age of when more episodes were starting to come out but this was the first part i saw before i saw origins Senor, look, Sonic is why do they up. look like that ah uh, what happened ah uh, i feel like i was just eating steak hoagies hey you guys are all okay oh yeah you're good now rouge fixed you man why didn't he have eyes what so the plan right now camera is guy cameo yeah do i like because jesus this whoa i am just tripping on acid okay listen we have to get to the giant building because it's a helicopter up there we're gonna have to find a way out of here because i have to get to the travel channel to tell you the best places to get a steak hoagie because i'm a commercial and a hedgehog i i get the joke now it's all about Mr. Roger Man, you know, being a, a commercial guy before he became the Sonic Man. That, that's, I get it now. I get the joke. Laugh. Ah, oh, senor, I am very scared right now. <laughs> Where are the tacos? Yeah, where are your tacos? Wait a minute. Okay. So so I, I was just about to ask here. that. Oh, no. Hey, the stuck. Oh, come on. Are you freaking kidding me? I, I spent all day while they had it out. So don't worry. I will take a look outside because I am the smartest and the biggest and the strongest. I will look. Sh Yo, Shadow, chill out, buddy. And Shadow saw the zombies. Uh-oh. I see the zombies. Get them, Shadow. I am going to shoot them. I hate zombies. What they did, I call... He's got a gun on his dick. <laughs> what? Every single one. Oh, that's so badass. What the hell? Dude, that's crazy. And Shadow decided to go and shoot the zombie in the face with a shot. Yeah. Oh, Chaos Blast. He finally used it. I dare anyone in the world to challenge me. I am the greatest. <laughs> Suddenly out of nowhere. There was a tank from Left 4 Dead. It's like one of my favorite games. I, I, yeah. I was, I was thinking like the Hulk made a cameo or something. You are not going to defeat me, tank, because I am Shadow the Hedgehog. I kill zombies with my gun. <laughs> it's even more funny when you think about how Keanu Reeves has just been cast as Shadow the Hedgehog. I'm going to need a gun. Oh, damn. All right, get him, Shadow. Beat his ass. Then when Shadow... Oh, uh, never mind. He's dead. Oh, oh, help me. I'm going to die. Oh, no. He's swinging me around. I get very motion sick. Help me. Help me. I'm going to die. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, God. No, please. I don't want to die. I'm too young. I just get hurt. Oh, my God. I don't know about young Shadow. You're over 50 years, give or take, you know, with the whole time stuff. Excuse me, but you're not going to fight my friend because he's my friend. And... And you can't do anything. Why do you have blood on your head? I think of some really lame and obvious pun because that's what they pay me for to not act, but to just, you know, commercial. <laughs> me too, bro. Me too. So then I started to beat the crap out of Sonic. <laughs> <laughs> that was great. Oh, oh. Remember, kids, if you don't understand what anyone's saying, just beat the absolute shit out of them. Suddenly out of nowhere. Oh my god. Damn, and that wasn't Shadow who used that gun? Dr. Roll Fat. Yeah, there it he is. <laughs> hey, Eggman. I mean, what are you doing here? The Eggmeister. Oh, did you see the thing? Is Why does he talk like that? You guys, the whole time, I have been watching Why does he talk before. like that? The thing is, is that I am actually on your side. I've been having to survive the zombies myself. So the plan is, I have seen the helicopter at the top of the building. <laughs> the helicopter. This is the uh, the helicopter. Get to the top of the building, stack the helicopter, and we are going to leave the ship. But there is... <laughs> 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 
what's the big yes, deal? Yes, make I mean, the booms said, bigger! Thing, but what's the one thing, my Dwarf? No, Jesus. Okay, that's too big. We have to kill the monster that summoned the zombies in the first place. Are we gonna kill Big the Cat? And who would that be? That would actually be uh, this giant green monster. He appears right now. Oh, just right Shut now, all right. Wait, Big's shaking. not Big's not green. With all that shaking, everything started to get really loud. And then the sky turned red. God damn, Big's busted, what? It was Godzilla! Huh? That was Godzilla. Yeah. And Godzilla was the lord of the zombies. You know, it makes sense. If Godzilla is able to suplex Kong, I imagine he's able to control some measly zombies. I mean, it makes sense. If you take one more step, I'm going to have to beat you up. Damn. My little virgin. Oh. And then Godzilla got really pissed off. Sonic, are you gonna take are you gonna take that, buddy? I got this. I'm Sonic, you're not. He speaks in the third person a lot in this one. And then Sonic started jumping all over him and smacking him in the puss. These are actually the craziest homing attack animations I've ever seen. A lot, a lot better than what we've seen in Sonic Forces. Okay, big green monster. I'm gonna have to make a few more puns, but first, I'm gonna show you my ultimate power. It's called the Pizza Storm because I'm an employee at Pizza Hut. Oh my God, we're really, we're really pushing on this Pizza Hut joke. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna transform any second now. Don't tell me he's just gonna be like green screen colored Sonic with like a bunch of pizzas on him. That'd be really funny. I summon the power of pizza. Yeah. For only ten bucks. You can get any large pizza only at Pizza Hut. That's not accurate in this day and age. You you can get a large pizza for $50. I don't know about right now. I, I would kill for a large pizza for $10. I guess he's dead. Yeah, that's what happens when you mess with me, Rock, I mean, Sonic the Hedgehog. All the MonsterVerse v movies that have come out for the past few years are completely irrelevant now because now we know we could just be using Pizza Hut to beat the shit out of Godzilla. We didn't need to go through this whole wake up King Ghidorah nonsense, get Kong on the surface to fight Godzilla because Godzilla was starting issues. We didn't even need to make Mecha Godzilla. It was unnecessary. We could afford a high quality, amazing uh, movie project like the MonsterVerse, but we actually couldn't afford to get all those pizza boxes and just start throwing them at Godzilla. That is too expensive in this economy. Don't forget to add breadsticks and a Pepsi for only five bucks extra, only at pizza. That is cap. Oh my God, look at all of the zombies are burning. <laughs> the zombies died. Yeah. So the show's over, we win. But there's like so many other parts. So how does this work? I guess this means we could go up to the building, get in the helicopter, and then we can watch the travel channel and I'll tell you everything you need to know. My question is, why do you need to go to the helicopter if you already killed all the zombies? Sonic and the gang then started running down the street because they were so happy because the zombies were all dead and then they could go home. Oh, okay. All right, fine. Makes and sense. on the top of the giant building was exactly what they were looking for. There's a helicopter over there. I need Rouge yes, to say it. Yes, can use helicopter to go home. I am so very happy. It is about time I get to go home. I had to scrub my little kitty cat and make sure I get more guns. Wait, 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 wait. No, not Shadow. No, not me. Why is it always me? It's probably because I'm black. Black guy always dies first, dude. Oh hey, my God. Man. First it was Knuckles and now it's Shadow. Because you see, Sonic, it is very simple explanation. I'm not going to share a helicopter with you. I only needed your help to defeat the zombies. Now, I'm going to take the helicopter for myself, go do things with it, take it home, yeah, I don't know, go back to Russia, and then, of course, most importantly, I'm going to kill all of you and throw you over the side of the building. Did he just <laughs> jump <laughs> off the building to make it more dramatic? Say your last word, Sonic. Baldy nose hair. Yes! <laughs> Back and pick oh no, please do not destroy me. I am too fat to die. It's Come actually on, the opposite, Eggman. To you're too you're too fat too to late. live. You're just like a buffet for these guys. Like, come on. Oh, oh for the Exodus! <laughs> what? I wanted to destroy Sonic too. 
So they started running at him. Camera guy cameo. Yeah. But then the tank jumped really far and missed his That's a classic Kefla moment right well, there. that was a pretty strong adventure. Oh, it was, Senor Sonic. I want to go home. Oh, yes, darling. I'm going to do things for you that you would never imagine. Oh, jeez. We never got to see Tales of Tacos. That was the end of the story. That's it? That's, sh that's it. That's just how it ends. Okay. I don't know how part three is going to end up, but I guess that's it. All right. That was a lot shorter than the first one, too. I think the first one was like 20 minutes or something like that. Um, well, hey, if you want to see more of it, if you want to see me react to the rest of the Sonic Zombies thing, stay tuned because I will I will do it. I will watch the rest. My name is Mimito Penny. I play other games. And in this case, I react to other things. If you want to go see those, they'll be in the description below or at the end of the video. Until you guys see me, though, I'll see you guys later.